Hey, Molly. I'm outside the studio. All right. Go over the wall and find the car on the lot. And then what? Only the principal actors and stunt people are authorized to go near it. So, you could get in wardrobe and play the part or try something else. All right. When you're out of there and clear of studio security, call me. Hell is Brandon. Jesus, are you, you gonna sit. find him? Someone's gonna find him. Where is my movie star? Where is my movie star? Anyone know who this guy is? Is this the new stunt guy? At least get him a mask or makeup hey, get or out something. Of there. Get that guy out of there. He's not signed get off. Out. Oh, 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 stop it. Stop it. Doing? What is going on? What are you doing? Is this a kidnapping? Pull over, creepo! Get off the wheel! I need to get the fuck out of here! Studio security are shutting your ass down, Blacko! Oh fuck, we're gonna lose these guys! Is this an abduction? Nah, you cool? No, I'm not cool. Not at all. I mean, chill out. I'm just interested in the whip. This button says spike. Fantastic! What do you mean, the whip? I could buy this... Oh, that's what's up. I could buy this car with what I make in a morning. I think you underestimate the value of this automobile. I overestimate your... Jesus! I overestimate your own talent. Oh, see you later! Uh... I think you're underestimating what I get paid. You get paid a couple million for a morning's work? Shit, I should sack my agent. Yeah, shit. Damn, what's this button? Yo, shit, I'm oh. If you have the car, bring it to Hayes Auto in South LS. Mr. Weston is marathon training, but he can reconfigure his route to meet you there. All right, cool. I got the car. No drum. That's good. The studio is enough of a money sink without the costs that that drama can bring. What kind of shape is the car in? We plan on refitting the guns to take live ammunition. Do the traffic spikes and ejector seat need replacing too? Uh, both of those are going to need replacing, all right? Good. One more thing. Mr. Weston's security detail are concerned about a suspicious figure near the garage. Let us know if you see something. Insurance companies hate these kinds of claims. They don't like cats with the inside edge shorting them either. So how'd it go? Smooth enough, you know. Movie people. You know what the irony is? I'm a major shareholder in that same studio, so we just did is practically legal. Ha! <laughs> practically. Oh shit! Look at this motherfucker. You doing it big, my nigga, on the set. Lamar, what the fuck are you doing here? Oh, chirped your boy Trevor. It's fucked up when you gotta get your GPS location on your homeboys through a motherfucking speed freak. True that. Devin Weston, master of the two-hour female orgasm. What it is, Holmes? Lamar Davies. 
He was just leaving. Hey, not on my account. You looking for gainful employment, homie? Hell yeah, I'm always trying to get some motherfucking paper. Just the type of guy I like to work with. Predictable. Hey, we could bring your boy here in on the last part of the shipment. Oh, yeah, nigga, that's exactly what you could do. That's exactly Hell what you yeah. could do right man, there, yeah, man. Exactly. If you want him in, then you get him to boost the rest of the shit you got. Oh. Give me my money and I can go on oh, with my motherfucking oh. life. Oh, no, am I sensing tension here, Slick? <gasps> He's the spirit. But you're the brains, am I wrong? I can see it. Look, I need you on point when we move this stuff out of town. Yeah, whatever, man. Call me when it's done. And after this, make sure we got our motherfucking check, all right? Ciao, baby. It is what it is. Yeah, whatever. Anyway, come here. I'm gonna put you in touch with my legal counsel. Hey, hey, don't touch me, homie. I don't get down like that. Yeah, let me tell you how the world works, Slim. No wise ass punk, now give me that. <laughs> Where you at, man? Your house is empty. Oh, hey. I had to kind of lay low for a while. Yeah, that nice Mexican we met. Me and T did that job for him, and we fell out. You gotta be joking. I wish I was. So where you at now? <sighs> Desert? Out by Alamo Sea? All right, well, I'll hit you if I find anything. Absolutely. Uh, oh, hey. Trevor's got his wife. Trevor's got a wife? No, no, the Mexican's wife. What? <laughs> Shit, I don't know what to say about that one. Nothing. Nothing to say about that. Run! Run! I'm back! Coming, Trevor! Uh, bring me my coffee, I'm gonna cut your arm off. Absolutely! <clears throat> Who the hell's that, your maid? Oh, business partner. Good guy. Very loyal. Ron, Ron, that is Michael. And this is Patricia. <laughs> uh, listen, 
something beautiful. You know, I'm sorry about everything that's happened. And, I, you know, I can't guarantee no harm's gonna come to you. I might have to chop you up into little pieces before spraying your pulp mess down the drain, but I really hope it doesn't come to that. I appreciate your honesty. You are a good man. I can see that. You need your eyes examined, then. Ron, you miss me? Yeah, Trevor, a bit, I mean. How's the fucking business? I, I, I tried. If you're gonna give me a sob story, I'm gonna rip your fucking throat out and shove a turd down the hole. It's not a sob story. It's just not quite come good yet. But I heard about something to do with Merriweather. Mm, those assholes Big again. cache of weapons they got coming in. So I thought you might want to, uh, requisition mm. it. Fantastic! Let's go! Come in. Whoa, no, 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 not you. Sit down. You're a wanted man. Stay low. Now watch her, okay? She's a good lady. Let's go, Ron. Good to meet you, Michael. Fucking come on, let's go! The weapons are coming in by air. We've got a plane over at the airstrip, but... Great! Right, let's go! What are you going to do? We're not going to take out a private army on the ground, Ron. we got to meet them in the air. I... Uh, okay, well, look, I knew that you were pissed after the Merriweather heist, giving back the hardware. That was bullshit! Right, right. So I've been monitoring chatter, tapping into Merriweather networks? Feels good to be back in the company of a professional. I gotta say, I gotta. Now, I was expecting something a little more impressive. The late, great Michael Townley. Not so late and not so great, right? And no longer called Townley. The years have not been terribly kind. What's the end game, man? We had a good thing going without him. If it's such a good thing, where's my money, huh? Where's my consultant's fee and my big fat dividend? I want a franchise network, Ron. I want reward cards and merchandise. I want to make gun violence and drug dependency accessible to every man and beast from Hove Beach to Vespucci. I want country clubs and a depressed wife with blonde hair and a hot little secretary who bounces on my boy. I need to take on a heavily armed, tax-funded militia. Get in touch with my Mexican contact. Tell him we got some guns to sell. I'll get you on the radio! Altitude! 
attitude corrected. You know, the cargo plane's got four jets, a 200-foot wingspan. Yeah, 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 and I'm in a crop duster. This is something I'm acutely aware of. Enough! So start monitoring you at that altitude! You know, Ronald! Ronald! You there? Reading each other! Ronnie, old boy, I never thought I'd say this, let alone think it, but it's good to be working together again. I can't tell you what a pleasure it is to have you back. We're a good team. Every team needs a leader, a leader, and a mindless follower, too. Keep low! Remember! Don't want to give them reason to think you're suspect. You got bad information, brother. I'm fine. I'm in control of this. Are you sure about this, T? Most certainly. These bricks, Merriweather, they're what? Using these guns for a coup in West Africa? Protecting some mineral-rich warlord? Confiscating the weapons is practically a public service. Karmically, I'm... We're golden! What's not to be sure about? When you put it like that... Handle your end, okay? You've got to defend, man. The military will be all over you. Altitude's just fine, Ron. This is Captain T in a 1989 crop duster. Just enjoying the beautiful San Andreas weather. Unidentified aircraft, divert your course or we will be forced to shoot you down. Really? Shoot me down? Well, that seems a little extreme, doesn't it?
got a pilot on board. Come in, air traffic control. There has been a change of personnel and destination on the Meriwether jet. We are now landing in Mackenzie Field. Swapping radio channels. Over. Ron! Ron, you there? I got the jet. You with the buyers? We are here, T. Awaiting your arrival.